Well, let's continue. So, we are going with scanning again, I suppose. What? Avatar all of a sudden. Commander, the aliens continue to make progress on the Avatar project. Well then, we're going to slow them down, can't really do much about that. So, I will need to go for Black Side at some point. Settlement supplies? I don't need supplies. We'll need to go for this eventually. But first of all, let's finish the West Africa contact. This will not take long. Now, the idea is that after this we eventually will go for Western Europe and then we'll be able to get to this base uh, from there. But I think South Africa is more important at the moment. Wait, what? Volunteer army. On every mission there is a chance that a resistance soldier will join the XCOM squad? What? That's ridiculous. Okay, we'll need to go for South Africa then. But I don't think I can do that, right? Because of the intel cost. Yeah, I cannot do this. So, that means that I might as well just build a relay. I don't need a relay right now. But I also don't like... I can't do anything else meaningful anyway. And I will need... I'll need it eventually. And there is also a UFO that like... Uh, disallows me from flying around. So I just will instead stay in place and uh, work on that relay. Seems like a good idea, anyway. Chosen sabotage our stash of black market gear? Was lost. What does that mean? What is our stash of black market gear? Okay. No idea, but okay. Cool. Oh. Covered action report. Templars, observers of purity. Find the Templars, reward faction hero, add a faction hero to XCOM's ranks, and gain new resistance orders and covered actions. Gained XP, increased cohesion, got promotion. And, uh, cool, continue. This is where the Templar faction maintains their headquarters. South America, okay. It can be a bit extreme when it comes to psionics, but so far they seem loyal to our cause. We can scan at this location to gain additional support from their people. Where's the formal introduction? My people understand the value of our cooperation, Commander. The Elders give us nothing more than raw materials for their design. We will take back our power and turn it against them. Oh, Are you melee? Commander, it's about time we spoke, don't you think? I'm Geist, leader of the Templar Order. But I'm sure you already knew that. Stories of me tend to spread far and wide. You are welcome here any time, Commander. For among all others of your kind, you alone know the true power of the Elders. You have touched their minds, you have heard their voice, and surely you know that they must fall. On behalf of all Templars, I humbly offer our services towards their demise. Together, we shall be unstoppable. Why are you speaking like a villain, anyway? With our success, comes what is this? Opportunity for you to assign us new orders, Commander. Oh. Well, that was an upgrade before, yes. Okay. So, I can... Uh, this is an order now, I suppose. Double the ability points gained in combat. Maybe. Well, let's see how it goes, anyway. So, promotion for my ranger, that's fine. What about new covered actions, though? Heal faster if I go there. Pursuit of knowledge. Laboratory facilities provide an additional 20% boost to research times. I don't have any laboratory facilities, whatever. I didn't press anything. I didn't... We just dragged the map around. I didn't even press it. Come on. Let's go back and build this relay. So, yeah, what was the bonus for... Uh, Europe? 
I don't think I'll be able to get to North America anytime soon. What about Europe, though? Research breakthroughs are twice as likely to occur. <sighs> eh, I don't know. Well, just continue with the relay for now. What about my... Yes, but... What about my covert actions? Could use a place yes. To what about them? Commander. You mean I can't do them anymore? Like a great but I was able to do it without any rings, though. What? Why? Okay, I mean, I will build it, but like... Oh. We what? We have to take evasive maneuvers. Commander, we've detected an alien UFO in close proximity to the Avenger and that is rapidly advancing towards our position. I can't do anything about it, it seems like, but like, I was on the ground, though. For 13, okay. Africa. Never had that happen before. Spike is our only chance of getting out of here. We can't let the aliens take this ship. So, a uh, ground mission then? Avenger defense. Defend the Avenger. Um, we'll need to go out of the ship though, right? Okay. Okay. Well, first of all, you all go out, and let's actually think about it. Um, I don't know. Well, you're the higher rank, the highest possible rank among our troops, so you'll have to participate. Run and gun or conceal? Oh, that's a tough one. Conceal is not that necessary with Reaper, potentially. Run and gun is good. Conceal is also good, though. Oh, this is a tough one. This is a tough one. But you will participate, that's for sure. Reaper will participate. Then uh, she is bonded with who? What's your bond? It was one of the Grenadiers. I don't remember which one. No, no, not this one, I think. I know you're tired, but not really a lot of choice, though. I think this one? Yes. Okay. So you're bonded. You will have to participate as well. And then I need another grenadier. And uh, sniper, maybe. Sniper is okay. Can use sniper. Who is the bondmate? I think it's. Uh... Oh, it's actually another grenadier. How did that happen? Six soldiers, by the way. Hmm. Well, I guess uh, Mox would be our sixth. The question is, do I want to use the bonded person instead? And get some... Some more bonded action. I think I don't really need it. On my sniper specifically, like a second shot on my sniper? 
It's not really that helpful. I think this setup is better. Like, I don't really want to use more tired people than necessary. So, something like this. Just a normal grenadier. And then I only have one medkit to give, really. So, maybe my sniper should have one. And that's about it, really. Where's my medkit? Like this. And that's about it. I can't really improve in any other way, I think. Reaper needs to happen. Ranger needs to happen, like at least one of them. Oh, promotion, right? Run and gun or conceal. Oh, that's a tough one. That is a tough one. I would really like both of them. I think on this mission I'll take Conceal. But honestly, at some point, I do need both of them. So maybe this will be the thing that I use my ability points on. Honestly. Seems like a good idea. But for now, though, let's just launch. Okay, let's see what happens. Well, at least it should be easier with six soldiers. So I assume we go out of uh, Avenger. Seems like it. Like, I expected a base defense mission of sorts in this game at some point. But it, it's not exactly a base defense, though. Okay, so what is happening? We need to kill this thing. There is a corner relatively nearby. Oh! Oh! That's very close, actually. Very close. Is there a timer? Doesn't seem to be a timer. Oh, maybe it's because we are concealed? Maybe it's because of the faction order? Though we kinda are not concealed, really. Only two of us are. Well, destroy the disruptor. Enemies must not reach Avengers ramp. So this place. I cannot let them there. Okay, well, let's start with some scouting. This seems like a good place for it. Can I proceed? Maybe... Oh man, it's difficult to see as is, even without this Reaper HUD. Can like get somewhere there, for example. But I assume there is nothing to my left. Hopefully. <laughs> it would be a ridiculous game. Hope there is nothing like that. In plans. Just go there then, maybe. This is good enough, honestly. I don't think I need to go closer. Oh. Two squads, it seems like. So this actually even might be dangerous. This is definitely dangerous. This might not be immediately dangerous, but it's close. Is this safe? Seems to be safe. Okay. Um, just get to, like, full cover for now. I think Mox is definitely in need of some full cover out of all of you. The rest is like whatever, honestly. But Mox kinda needs it. What if I use Justice and I pull one of them in and they end up in this area? Do I just auto lose? Will I see them if I move there? I can actually do one more move. That might be a good idea right now. Let me see more of them. Oh, I'll just trigger like all of them. No, this is safe. This is safe, but... Um, well... But I kind of need to move closer, though. That is the issue. Well, we're in position. Let's see. Just Overwatch. I assume they will move closer and uh, trigger. Yep. Yeah, our first encounter with Mech in this game, in this playthrough. 
Oh, okay, that's a good start. But the bad news is, I assume there will be... Second pack triggering as well. <laughs> and that's not fun. But... Oh my god, there's three of them actually. That is nasty. Reinforcements? What reinforcements? Here's the idea, right? I can uh, get those two people. Potentially I can explode them both with a bond. So potentially those two are dead. This mech though is a bit of a problem. But let's say I grenade it. And then I can just kill it with like... Some random shots. Maybe shotgun blast. Who is bonded? Wait, what the hell? I didn't move my... Who are you? Oh, you're reinforcements! You're reinforcements! God damn! Okay. That's good. Uh, who is bonded with my... Um, with my Reaper? Who is Claudia Schneider? Are you Claudia Schneider? Yes. Okay. I think uh, here's what needs to happen. So, Claymore needs to happen. Then I might even... I think if it's like this... Can, can I... Can, can I see better? Like this, right? No, maybe... Can it be like one tile further? Like, like this. Like this, look. The point is, it's almost touching the mech. If it goes there, right? And it all also almost touches the guy to the right. So if I remote detonate it later, it should actually get both of them. Including the guy in the middle. And it should be good enough to kill all three, I hope. That's the hope. Let's see if it works. Oh, you can even move after that. Oh, damn. Wait, why can't you remote start? Wait, what the hell? Why? Huh? Why is that not a thing? Why is it not active? But I can see it. I can see it. Like, I can shoot at it, so that means I can see it as well. Oh, it's an, an environmental explosive. It's not the claymore. It's specifically, it specifically refers to, um, to something that already was on the map, I suppose. Oh my god. Well, I mean, I will still need to do that, though. That definitely is a bad move then overall, like, it could have been better, for sure. Like, at least I could have killed one more guy with that, but, I mean, not a lot of choice, right? At this point, I kind of need to do something like that. So 61% for this hit. Well. Claudia Schneider can actually do some grenading, potentially. I do need full covers. This one is good. I shouldn't trigger anyone else, so this should be decent. We need to kill the closest mech for sure. And we also kind of need to spread out, actually. So ideally I would like to get this tree out, because... Uh, I need to see it with my... with Pratal Mox, ideally. So if this tree can go away, that would be nice. Because Pratal Mox doesn't have any targets currently. That's a bit of a problem. Can grapple, though. Actually, maybe I should grapple. Still can't really get this tree out, so you still can't see it then? You can see it now, okay good. Uh, I can grapple though, and maybe I should. This is a good uh, place to be. Yeah, because this should be cover, this should be full cover. And it actually gives me more... ...chance to hit. 97% there, and potentially 87% for this flanked guy. Can also Justice Purifier, but why? But why?
Lightning hands, which is not useful at the moment. Okay, look. I can make like one pistol shot with the sniper if I get closer for the smack and then potentially kill it with two shots from Mox. What about the rest of them though? Can you kill this one maybe? Just one hit will be enough. Let's try it. I need to kill them. Good. There is still a mech that is a problem. I can't really do much about this mech. Yeah. Like, I will do this, I think. I'll just do a double shot and try to do something. Maybe a shotgun? No, 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 no. Let's just do a double hit. It will not be good enough, but... Maybe. Maybe you can, like, you know, hit it... Yeah. For four damage, at least. So I should be able to always kill it with a sniper shot, with a pistol shot specifically, from there. Now, the most important part is that all of my people should be in uh, full cover. That's the main idea. Okay, that's good. If you'd missed, there would, would have been some issues. Ideally, you would get to full cover... And then kill the second guy instead. But this is not achievable. It's only one or, or the other. And you need to move as well. Oh, this is a good shot potentially. But um, very unlikely to work. I really would like to kill this trooper. But it's uh, it's only achievable if I want to end up in half cover. And no, I think I'm just shooting. Oh. Okay, can I kill it actually? Can I kill it now? I sometimes can kill it. 100%. It's about 80%. If I understand correctly. If I miss, it just moves closer and I think it just flanks me. I can get a bit further. Yeah, I think this is the move. Get a bit further and hit it. And try to one-shot it, potentially. 97. It's basically the same chance now, but it will not be able to flank me, though. Okay, good. It was about 80%. Okay, only one guy is left and then there are reinforcements, obviously, but we'll deal with that. I don't see them though, right? Either of them even. Wow. Interesting. Overwatch then? Okay. Well, I'm okay with that. Let's uh, reload. Ha. Huh. This is actually <laughs> this is interesting. So here is the here is the thing, right? If I put my snipers into Overwatch... Oh no, they can't actually... For now, they don't have an ability to... Um, to trigger Overwatches on uh, squad side. So they will only be able to shoot if the target moves within their radius. You know what? I should get a bit further from them. I don't want to trigger them if I can help it. So maybe get my... Ranger a bit further, right? And then we just wait and hopefully deal with this left pack first. And then... And then... We deal with the right pack as well. But only after that, though. Overwatch. 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 And then you... You are a bit of a problem. I can actually try to flank them. Potentially do something like that, for example, right? Mm. Is there anything better that I can do? Probably not, honestly. It's probably the best move I have available. Yeah, okay. Oof. Oof. Let's deal with this pack, though, first of all. 
Okay, they should come towards me. Done. Three left. Oh, 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 that's bad. <laughs> oh, that's bad. Why did you even come there? Oh, that's such a bad movement for me. I might actually trigger all of them now because of my Reaper positioning. Yeah, that's really bad. Uh-huh. Well, at least that's good, I suppose. If it, if he hits, <laughs> he doesn't. Okay, that's a hit at least. So six of them are left, right? Five? Five? Five, okay. That's good news. Oh, it jumps off. Can it actually jump back? No, 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 please, no, please, no, please. No, 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 no. Eight. That's bad. I, re I really didn't expect they, they would come towards me like that. Commander, I'm sending reinforcements in from the Avengers reserves. Commander, Good. The situation just got worse. <laughs> <laughs> you think? <laughs> you think? <laughs> I can get a grenade there, potentially. Okay, let's say my Reaper could hide somewhere like, not there I suppose, but like there. Well, I'll not be able to um, flank this guy. Oh, there's so much stuff happening, we'll lose some people there. We will lose some people. So I can do a frag grenade on two of those, kinda needs to happen. For that, I would need to get closer. This is as close as I can get. While still being in full cover. This will be the position. If it's not good enough, then I'll just do it with someone else. So let's start with that. This is good enough. This is happening. This is happening. Um, the problem is, it will probably... It will probably uh, light fire on this uh, grass all around the place. So my Reaper will still need to move first, most likely. There are two ways for my Reaper to go. One way would be to just bail completely. Maybe move like there, right? It's dangerous, but everything is dangerous for everyone. So it's not like... Not surprising, really. Can just move there, maybe. Hmm. Well, I mean, there is no good tile, regardless, so I might just as well move there for now, and then see what happens. This guy will not be able to get. Ideally, I would just kill this guy. If I could move on this tile, this would be perfect, actually, but I cannot. And I'll not be able to, so... There is not much I can do, right? If I cannot really flank this guy, then I should just bail. I should just bail. I think my first move would be there. And then I probably just run back even further, most likely. Well, we'll see, we'll see. But first, I need to get out of there, though. And then my next move is a grenade that will just be... Getting those two guys... I need to get some of this armor out, I need to kill the psionic guy, and stuff like that. Cannot get his cover though, that's the issue, but, but, maybe Mox will be able to get justice, to get some justice done, yeah. He would still be able to make a second move, right? I think it's uh, one shot. And then I do justice. And someone else will need to finish off the mech. <laughs> How do I do that? 
Ah, oh, how do I do that though? Oh, that's so horrible. What about my ranger? Hell no. I can get another grenade there, but what's the point? Even if I hit him with a... Even if I hit the mech with a grenade... It wouldn't really help much. Oh, oh. I can't get to the mech, that's the issue. Teamwork on Reaper. Interesting. Interesting, but it doesn't really help much. I need my moves in other places. I cannot really do much with that stuff. Oh, you can get the mech. Oh. Oh, that needs to happen. Okay, I have a plan then. It's not a good plan. It's not a good plan, but... Um, here's what needs to happen then. So, you need to try to get like one shot onto that mech. Good, good, good. Now, ideally, you do justice on this guy and kill it. The choice is made. Oh, we needed it. We needed it. If that failed, that would have been so bad, you have no idea. Now, here is the next thing, right? So, this sniper, this sniper, can actually shoot the mech, but before that, uh, I need to do lightning hands shot at the sectoid, just because I can. But for that, though, I kinda need a grenade there. So, I think I'll start with that, and we'll try to deal with that sectoid, first of all. Um, I'll not be able to deal with this cover, though. But regardless, like, I might as well try. Maybe do two grenades. And then I'll be able to deal with this, with this cover. I don't know, maybe, but then again, maybe not. Let's just start with a grenade, okay? Because uh, there is not much useful stuff that I can do anyway. With my people currently. Might as well just try to get the sectoid who is in my shooting range. Why not? Maybe do double grenade or something. Yeah, I'm doing a double grenade, I think. So, I can even get a grenade from my current position. Do I have more grenadiers? Yes. So, can you get it there? No. Can you get closer? Not really. Not without any risk. Like, there are no good full covers. Oh, this is rough. I need you to do a grenade. I need you to get there, I think, and do a grenade. Which means you'll be probably targeted by the Viper. But we'll just ignore Viper for like two turns. And this should be fine for now. You will need to get there, I'm sorry. But yes, you will be targeted. You will be targeted. You will be wounded. By the end of it. Oh! Oh, that changes things. What about my sniper? Oh, okay. Well, that will happen. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's uh, continue with the grenade, though. Let's continue with the grenade. So, this will happen. And the idea is uh, that my sniper now will be able to actually shoot this guy with a pistol for free. Right? Sniper. Not this sniper. This sniper. So, lightning hands... And just try to kill the sectoid. There's a good chance, like 50% maybe. Are you serious? We really need to hit those shots, guys. We really need to. You need to kill the mech, though. That's the main idea. Okay, that was the main point. You did that, so thank you for that. That's fine, that's fine. That's okay. As long as you can do that, we, we're fine. Next thing. You need to shoot someone. Sectoid needs to die, first of all. For that, you need to get closer. Or, if you cannot get closer, without compromising your position, and it seems like you cannot get closer, then you will need to do teamwork. So let's start with your shot, then. 
But then again... If you just hit your shots, then we don't even need teamwork. So just try to kill the Sectoid. And then even... She can't really do much more than that. Kill the Purifier. There is still Viper and two mechs though. Oh, god damn it. People, I think you misunderstand the importance of this. I can kill it. But I'll need to expose myself. I'll need to go in half cover for that. I can get the grenade there. And also drop this mech, potentially. That is actually decent, but it will be half cover. Alternatively, I can overwatch. Everyone is in full cover currently. But I'll still probably lose some people if I just skip like that. If I go closer, I'll uh, kill this guy. I'll do some damage onto mech. But that's about it. And I'll expose myself. And I'll probably lose the soldier for sure. I'll probably still lose soldiers even without doing that, but... I think Overwatch is better. I don't know, I hate it. I hate it. Let's just see what, what happens. Reinforcements, but whatever. Whatever. Just two soldiers. I don't care about two soldiers. Yeah, whatever. Out of everything that is currently happening in this mission, this is like the least important thing. There is also one more group, by the way, um, was that was shown there to the right of them. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Well. That actually is a horrible position. Okay. That's okay, I can kill it. What about you? You can jump back. Mm. And then? What is it? Suppression? Uh-huh. Panic? Panic. Uh huh. Well, at least you shoot, I guess. What's the point if you miss, though? Well, I mean, that went pretty badly, but honestly, it could have gone worse, so. You will do two shots. I can probably kill this guy with someone else. What do we have? We have a grenade. We have another grenade. We have a sniper shot. No, we don't. We have a pistol shot, actually. Let me see those grenades. So let's say one grenade goes like this. And then what? Let's say a shotgun blast onto this guy, right? Probably kills him. What about this one? How do we deal with that? I don't know. I'll need two shots at this mech. Let's say I kill this one with one shotgun blast. And then we still, like, uh, we cannot deal with this mech ever. So here's the problem. We have five soldiers. Or six. Six, I think, at this point. So four, five. Where's the sixth? This is the sixth. Yeah, six soldiers. So six shots. Six actions in total. Seven, if you count Mox as well. He can do two actions. So seven actions. This guy is dead in one action. Let's say I use, like, two more to kill the mech. Three actions. Four. But maybe one more to kill this one. Five. And probably one more to kill this one. 
and two actions extra. So it should be enough. It should be enough. Okay, let's just start then, okay? Let's just start. Uh, I cannot do much with this mech, which means this guy with suppression should go last and probably just suppress it. Most likely. So you will go uh, behind full cover. Like this, for example, right? And you will start the action with frag grenade that would kill this mech, will kill the soldier and wound the mech. Do some armor piercing more like on the mech. Okay, now I will need two shots for the mech. You can only do pistol shots, which is a problem because I don't need pistol shots. Maybe you will reload though, we'll see how that goes. You can definitely just do a shotgun blast and I think this will be happening because this guy needs to die. And yeah, I don't see a problem. I can move a bit further and potentially like avoid being detected by the reinforcements, but I don't think that's my issue at the moment. I really need to hit this, so I'll need to get as much uh, of a good shot as possible. Let's just do this. Good. Now, I can do grenade there. I can do one shot and one grenade. Oh, you also need to move like behind some cover, but ideally, ideally you need. But can you? Well, if she moves to somewhere, some, uh, some other place, like there for example, then potentially, yeah. You could move there instead. But can I kill the mech, though? And that's the question. Well, let's start. So, first of all, I need to uh, shoot at this guy once. See if I hit. Good. And then I will also need one grenade on this guy as well. Because he's a problem as well. I need to actually kill him. What the? Did you lose your cover? That wasn't even remotely close! Look at where the explosion was! How did that happen? What the hell? Well, at least the guy is dead. But come on, game, that's ridiculous! That wasn't even remotely close! Oh, come on! Well, now I need to suppress this the right mech. It needs to happen. So, I mean, I don't know, you need to shoot then. I'm sorry, but like, yeah. We need to kill it now. Another option would be to shoot at it with a pistol, with this sniper. But at 72% and then do a grenade. And then we would be able to kill it, but like... I mean... I might as well just do a sniper shot instead. I mean, it needs to die now. I'm sorry, but like, yeah, it needs to happen. <laughs> of course you do. Well, I mean, that's it. Mox will be dead. What the hell? That didn't make any sense whatsoever. Well, I need to kill it, so you get closer. I can do a grenade and then... Uh, just a normal shot. A pistol shot from my sniper. But it doesn't really provide a better chance. Can get closer as well. Might as well at this point. Why not? I have so many exposed targets. It doesn't even matter. Teamwork with whom? With the sniper. No, no, you should shoot. Well, it's dead, but like the second one will just kill me though. I can't do much about that. Um, Just reload, I think. Yeah, just reload. I don't have time. I need to reload. Oh, you do have one more action. Interesting. I can overwatch, but it will still move towards me, so... This is interesting. Huh. I can heal. I shouldn't heal, I'm pretty sure. I think it's a mistake to heal the... Healing, like, um... For this soldier, hmm... 
What if it does like AoE attack, for example? It or like any other enemy? What if they do just an AoE attack, for example, on... Well... Wouldn't they rather do that on my uh, troops right there or to the left? I don't think like healing does much. In fact, wouldn't I rather they did AoE attack on my sniper than on my actual exposed troops that will just die in droves if the attack goes for them instead? I think I would just rather shoot, honestly. This is just seems better, honestly. At least I can do some damage and, you know. Yeah, well, you kill someone, obviously. Mox? Oh, well, that's worse, actually. <laughs> you kill two of them. Reaper is out, and uh, Grenadier is also out. Well, 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 well. Not much I can do about that. That's very unfortunate, obviously. So I can reload. I can actually get this loot. And also reinforcements, hell yeah. I can do combat protocol. How much damage does it do? If I get a bit closer, like this. On my way. Six, seven. That's uh, sometimes enough to kill it, actually. Let's try it. If it works, I can actually do some... Scouting? Maybe, and... Uh... And safely prepare for the for the next encounter. Uh. I want to get this loot. Might as well at this point, honestly. Sure. Not a big fan of losing those troops. I'll need to reload. I'll need to shoot. And we, in general, need to get out of this place. I can always use this grenade if I need to. So let's first see if I can just... Shoot at this guy. Can I shoot at it from there? Let's do this. Get there. Get this shot in. And then let's see what I can do in terms of overwatches and stuff like that. Oh joy, Overwatch, Overwatch, get out of there, I don't care where, just out, actually can conceal, concealing is fine, yeah okay, let's do conceal, can you reload, you can just stay there, it's okay for now, if you're concealed. I need to jump out, but it might be dangerous. What if I try to grapple? You can actually grapple there, really. Well, just get there for now. Just get further. A uh, sniper will prepare for the next engagement. For that, she would need to reload. I'm more worried about already existing reinforcements. Okay, let's see what is happening currently. Nothing. We can potentially proceed there and try to catch them. I know that one of the... One of the groups that is still left is currently triggered. Come on, get back in fight. Can you grapple? Potentially could grapple there, for example. I think this is a decent position then. Probably should just stay there for now. Um, you overwatch, probably. You get closer, maybe. Maybe not. Get a little bit closer. A little bit. And just wait. Reload for now. Overwatch. Overwatch. Hmm. Maybe get some better position. 
This is like a better position potentially. Reload. Get closer. Overwatch. And yeah, well, we need to uh, move for sure. We need to actually kill the thing. Those are not that dangerous though. We do need to move, but... There are three groups, I think, on this map currently. This one, then another reinforcement pack like this. And they do trigger immediately, okay. And then there was uh, one more group, I think, that I saw. Like a glimpse of it. That is still not triggered yet. Commander, I'm sending reinforcements in from oh. The Avengers reserves. Hello, who are you? Just a grenadier. Okay, that's good. Um, well, huh. Huh. Well then, can hit this guy potentially. I think I need to ignore them and I need to proceed. I need to get this thing. I cannot really safely proceed though when there is a group nearby that can just get me. This is nasty. Can it like jump? There is a ladder there, so he can actually definitely climb uh, at this place. Seems horrible. All of my options seem horrible. Do I have grenades? I have at least three grenades, yes. If I move there, can I get him with this grenade? Okay, I think I'm shooting then. Whatever. I do need to proceed somehow. If I'm just staying in place, then um, I'm not sure. Like it, it might actually get much worse potentially. So I need to do something. Maybe I should have uh, moved there first. I need to get Mox in uh, play as well, somehow, so he needs to get closer. Going to this rock is a bit too dangerous at the moment. Snipers will just overwatch, I think. Well, you should get into a better position. But overall, though, that would be true. So, get maybe... Maybe there. Or like... I don't even know, man. There? Overwatch from there, maybe? You overwatch. You should get a bit closer as well, ideally, yes. But maybe next turn? I can just overwatch for now. Overwatch, overwatch, overwatch. Overwatch, overwatch. And then you also do something like that, yes. And let's just see what happens. And then we need to proceed, for sure. Okay, right, well. No idea how you see it, but... <laughs> Hit it somehow, apparently. Okay, then. That's it for this group. Okay, l let's proceed, let's proceed. I need this position. Who can get it? Mox. Try it and see what happens. Do we see anything? No. Uh, next one is my ranger. Well, ranger would probably be able to see them. And they shouldn't be able to flank him currently. So maybe just leave him at uh, his current position. Maybe get him like there though. The this should be safe. Then we just wait. You just change position slightly. Also, you try to get a better angle. On the move. And then what? It is clear. I need to get someone at least closer. We just... We're moving too slowly at the oh, moment. I'm not happy now. with that. Just a lot of overwatches, yes, but like... Just overwatch. I'm really not happy about this. 
If they just come in one group after another like this, I'll be able to deal with them. But the problem is it might get worse with time and... Uh... If like other groups start to move all of a sudden, at some point, it might get much, much, much worse. Or, or if uh, something like this happens, yes, that's also really bad. We need to hit something at least, sometimes. Well. Good. We do have a lot of grenades, actually. Oh, yeah, maybe it's not that bad. We do have a lot of grenades. So, if we just can uh, get more grenadiers in, then it's not that bad. I can just do something like this. This will need to happen. Let's just start with that. Now, potentially, Mox should be able to grapple onto the higher ground like this. And kill at least one of them. This is dead. This one is probably also dead. Can we proceed though after that? Horrible cover all around. Horrible cover. I'll need to get on uh, this tile. Can you try to do this? Will you die when you do that? Will, will you like trigger anyone else? Doesn't seem like it, okay. You'll be our scout then. So anyway, Mox. You shoot this guy. And you also shoot this guy. Well, and then let's proceed. I mean... You overwatch, you get closer and overwatch. You get closer. I really need more people on the high ground, I think. Oh, this is so bad. There is nowhere to proceed, like, uh, all of the cover is destroyed. Oh, I hate it so much, man. Let's see. Okay, okay. So action does start happening. Guys, I need to hit sometimes, you know? Very close, very close. Almost a perfect shot. Was just slightly bit unlucky. I can kill those, that's fine. So, um, look. Can you, like, proceed in some clever way? I can kill this guy, this is not a problem. You reload. You still have your turn, right? Yes. So, just kill this guy. Hopefully. And then we just overwatch. Honestly, what about my specialist? Can I move to this rock, for example? Okay. This should be good enough to overwatch. And you all just overwatch. Overwatch, overwatch, overwatch. I cannot proceed yet. I need to kill this group. Unless there is a timer that I'm not aware of. Something like this, and then we just overwatch. I mean, look, the problem is, my uh, scouting, my advance would be through this side. So if I want to advance on this map, I cannot advance through the middle, because it's destroyed, there is nothing. So I would need to advance there, but if I advance right now, then this reinforcement pack will be right behind me. So I cannot do that, yet. So I'll need to kill it first, and uh, not a lot of options, really. You just have to stay there for one turn and just kill them. Uh, reload, probably. I don't think you'll be able to do any overwatching. 
realistically, but maybe you will. Let's see. I can kill them. It doesn't really even matter at this point much. I think I can kill even, like, sectopods and stuff. Even if that happens, it's not that bad. But yeah, we do need to advance, though. We do need to. I think, aside from this pack, there should be uh, four more people on this map. One stun lancer that should be triggered. Oh, that's so bad, by the way. They run in the wrong direction. There is one stun lancer that should be triggered. And then there is one untriggered pack that I need to do something about. Why is my specialist not overwatching? What the hell? Are you serious? Can you actually shoot? No? Yes? No? Ever? What? He just ignored it? Are you a pacifist? Yeah, yeah, I'm also surprised. I agree. Look, we need to advance. Uh, I can kill... And pro I probably can kill this guy with two shots. We need to get closer. Can you, like, start moving, actually? Maybe there? You will do, probably, combat protocol on this uh, mech. What about my snipers? What? Hello? I think... I see. I think you misunderstand who the villains are in this game, man. You shouldn't talk like that on our side, I think. Templars gain focus during missions by killing units with rend. Each point of focus increases the Templar's combat effectiveness by boosting their mobility, dodge and rend damage. Focus can also be spent on powerful abilities, which have increased in fact effectiveness when used at higher focus level. Whatever. Just get closer. Can you see anyone? No. Then you just dash, actually. Just dash. Yeah, whatever. You need to get closer. Need to move. <sighs> Let's just go, then. This is so dangerous. I would like to make this move, actually, but for this, I would need both of those to be dead. I can kill the mech with a grenade. What about my snipers? Let's actually do this shot. If you hit, then maybe I can do something about it. Of course you can't. I have noticed. What about my second sniper? Nothing. Well, I can get the... Um, I can get the buff, actually. I, I can kill it, probably, with a pistol shot. Or even with a grenade, honestly. I don't really need grenades for my sniper, anyway. So just get there. Get a grenade in there. Out. You can't really do anything, anyway. Let's see if grenade can get there. No, it can't. It can't. Well, she wouldn't... Wouldn't be able to do anything meaningful, anyway. I can kill those people. Those people are not a problem. The problem is there are more. And if I trigger them just like that randomly, I can just die. That's the issue. Maybe advance through the lower ground. That's even more dangerous. By the way, Mox, can you, um... Can you actually... Can you justice? Oh, maybe this is better. Actually, yes, yes. Okay, let's uh, do one shot at the mech then. Oh yeah, that simplifies it. And then justice. So if this 99% hits... Good. Then I can just kill it from the lower ground. I have a lot of people that can do that. So, Specialist now can just advance. Not too much further. It's actually very dangerous to advance like that. But at least he can jump and uh, see if anything is happening directly below me. This will be probably the position to end my turn on. I need to advance. Okay. 
And we can kill this guy. So you can do something now, no? You have my trust. What can you do? Rant. Well, need to get closer, it's melee apparently. Melee attack with a chance to stun or disorient, whatever, Volt. Psionic attack that deals low damage but jumps to nearby unit. I don't... It's not... That's not the problem right now. Okay. So, can someone kill it with like... Who is nearby, relatively? You also need to advance. Let's start with you. Good. That simplifies it. So, we need to get people out. We need to, uh, we need to proceed. No, this, this is the place. And then one more would need to go behind this rock. You just get closer, it doesn't matter. You just reload Overwatch. You Overwatch normally. You get a bit closer, and everyone Overwatches. We can kill them. I don't care about them. The issue is there are more people. Let's go and see them. Do we see them? Not yet. I will just stay there, though. He's not in danger, right? I don't think so. Maybe he would be. Let's get there. It's full cover, and it's uh, it shouldn't really be that much worse in terms of what I can see from that position. And let's just wait. I mean, we can just kill them pretty easily. It's not, it shouldn't be a problem. Maybe get my Templar to some more useful place. I mean... You need to change your position. Your position is garbage. Garbage. Maybe this one. And just Overwatch. Reload Overwatch. Reload Overwatch. Reload Overwatch. Overwatch. Reload Overwatch. Overwatch, 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 let's go, Overwatch. Well, it's not a particularly worse than the previous set of reinforcements, so... Should one... should go fine, overall. Oh, that's bad. That's good. Any hit is good. Very good. That's incredible. What happened? Why are you hitting all of a sudden? Yeah? Wow. That's actually ridiculous. Every single one of you hit. That's just abnormal. Okay. Immediately a new, new reinforcement pack. Seriously. Well, I do need to proceed though. Hmm. Well, let's just go there and see if it's that dangerous or not. I need to see this thing. Oh, I see them. Yep. Four. Yeah, so three is normal pack, pretty much, and then one more Lancer that I already knew from before, so... Can do some shots. I'll need to overwatch. I'll need to get away. Need to go there. Get them to follow. The sectoid is a problem. Sectoid is a big problem. Well, let's just shoot. There is also this reinforcement pack that I need to do something about. 
But at least those are actually last enemies on the map. So as soon as I get them, that is good enough. Oh, they just jump down again. Oh, that's so annoying. No, they can't this time. They're too close. I can actually just get them from there. Overwatch, probably. I think this is this position is okay-ish. Where is Sectoid, by the way? Is this the Sectoid? Yeah, Sectoid is too far. I don't think it matters. I can Overwatch. You should probably just Overwatch, yes. You should Overwatch for sure. I can actually potentially use your grenade later, so you Overwatch. You get back. You Overwatch. Overwatch. Well, actually can reload and Overwatch. And you can get closer, but... Yeah, I can get a little bit closer as well. And Overwatch. Get closer and Overwatch. Overwatch. Overwatch, Overwatch. Well, at least they're not jumping off a cliff anymore. Because that's very annoying. This one is dead. Uh, now you actually do need to hit those shots and you can't anymore, huh? Hello. bad. You need to hit stuff like that. We actually do need it. It's a good dash, though. I like that dash. Good. And one more. Is he dashing? No, it doesn't seem like it. Oh, that's really bad. Good. Well... Good news is, that's uh, all of them for now, and there are no reinforcements yet. I need to kill this guy because he's very close to the zone. Can, like, rent. 100% 5 or 6 damage. Where are my snipers, first of all? I can do a lightning hands shot at any of them. I think this would be good, then I can kill him guaranteed with the Templar, if it hits. And if not, then I will have to do something else. So let's start with that. Good. Now he's dead with Templar. Let's do that immediately, in fact. Rand, and let's see how that works. Works pretty well, turns out. Now, mech. I need a grenade, I think. This guy needs to die. Yeah, there are a lot of people that need to die. I know, I know. Uh, you can see the only, only this guy, but you can, like, move closer. That's not particularly problematic. I think the idea is right now, the idea is uh, to kill those two, maybe try to get this guy as well, if I can get him with like a grenade, for example. Can I- what? What? Templar momentum and parry. After using Ren, Templar always trigger momentum, a free movement action which allows them to return to the safety of cover. If the Templar has the parry ability, they can instead use momentum to stay in the same location and prevent all damage from the next attack made against them. I see, so just free movement. That is okay, you can move closer. Look, mm. 
look. I need to kill um, those two. Those two. And then either we kill this one, if my grenadier can actually get a grenade there. Which he can't. Maybe from this position? Sectoid will be able to get me. But as long as we kill this guy, really it's not a problem. I can even rush them down. I can even kill the sectoid potentially if I just go for it. Let's say I get there. I think this is the move that needs to happen. You can only see two targets, which is fine. So the sectoid will have to go closer to you to be able to see you. I think this will happen. Ig ignore them, ignore them. So I will kill those three, probably. This is my, my goal for this turn. And then those two will still be alive after that, but we'll deal with that. So that means, let's start with Mox, actually. Mox can do either one attack or two attacks, and then he will stay in half cover. Oh, by the way, I did get the ability. I did get a move point from my ability. So it's three attacks, actually. Let's start with this guy, probably. Do I still have my reload? Yes. No. No, actually, I didn't. I actually didn't. So, hmm. I need a grenade for this one. Probably. Or just shoot it normally. You will need to shoot someone anyway. Might as well, I guess. 80%. Let's start with that. Good. Now, can I kill it with a shotgun blast? It should be possible from this position. Where is my assault ranger? Get closer. And uh, one shotgun blast. Not exactly. Well, it did happen. Was not guaranteed, though. And then this guy needs to die. And then, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, oh, yeah, yeah. I can kill him uh, with, like, a grenade or something. So, let's just start with this one instead. We can definitely try at least to get the second one as well with the uh, snipers right now. That's very useful if we can do so. Um, snipers... There are a lot of targets potentially, so ideally someone else does this. For example, you don't have anything to do anyway, so you might as well just... You can actually stay in place, honestly. You don't have to move. They will be able to get to someone anyway, so you might as well just, you know, try to do some damage. In fact, you can actually go in. You can go in like there and get a grenade on this onto the sectoid. But then again, let's just kill the stun lancer. Good. Then I only need to kill one guy that I can do like with, for example, this frag grenade always. That's not a problem. So that frees up my sniper shots. Might as well try to get the sec to it. And yes, I would like to get uh, another grenade there, maybe. What about like me getting closer and trying to get the sec to it with a grenade? Only half cover though. Even if I can get it there. Oh, but I really want to, though. I really want to. It's very risky, but... No, I cannot. Hmm. I'll have to go into cover, then. Like this. Okay. Well. You know what? First of all, let my grenadier... This one. Uh, just try to kill this guy normally. If he misses, we need to do something about it then, but maybe he just hits? That makes it easier. Okay, my snipers. Then. You can definitely shoot. 
Because you have two uh, bullets anyway, so might as well just make a pot shot and see if it works. And... Uh, mm, this does not really provide any results realistically, but, uh, you know, some damage. I don't know. Okay. Okay. I think I'm just overwatching then. Yeah, I think so. I'm just overwatching. If they get closer, at least I can uh, just kill them sometimes. I'm not afraid of Sectoid though, that's the issue. I'm more afraid of the Lancer. Sectoid would just do some stupid shit like mind control and stuff like that. And he's dashing, so he's also not a threat. Okay, this mission is over. There shouldn't be anyone else. That doesn't matter, though I should be careful about that. It's on a lower ground. Okay. Now, um, get closer to this thing. Can you see it? How can I see it? From there, maybe? Can you see it now? Can you see it, actually? Yes. Can my snipers see it now? Yes. Okay. Uh, well, let's start working on it. I don't need to get closer. In fact, like, my whole team can just work on uh, getting those reinforcements out while we're just killing the thing. Overwatch? Reload and then Overwatch, probably. You just go into cover, please. This would be the best uh, position. Get some high ground and you will still be able to hit them. Um, same idea if you can. Okay, you can. This is good. And then you can't really do anything else, so just reload Overwatch. And you just Overwatch normally. Reload Overwatch. You just reload Overwatch, Overwatch. This should be enough for this pack. That's fine, not a problem. Yeah. Let's go. What about my snipers? Ooh, that's nasty. I, uh, yeah, I'm aware. Well. You can't even see this thing. Perfect, I suppose. Okay, just kill it. I'll need one more hit. I'll need to get someone there. Though potentially my sniper can just kill it. Okay, okay. I think I have a plan. So, first of all... You will need to reload, obviously. Because you can't really do anything anyway. And you will just have to overwatch then. Well, you're overwatching. Nothing else I can do there. You just do this hit. Might as well, because you need to reload after that. And someone needed to do that. Then uh, my Templar... It's either that I just move closer and kill this guy. I should actually, yes. Because then I will get free movement and will be able to get closer to the next pack after that. To the reinforcements pack that is currently happening. If I understand correctly, actually, this should be safe. Because they will not be able to see me, most likely. Though, I don't know. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe not. I don't know. There is no safe spot, though. That's the issue. This should be safe. Whatever. Just get back. 
And you all should get closer and overwatch. You definitely should overwatch from uh, up there. They should come up the ladder and overwatch. Fine. They should, but who knows, man. You get closer and overwatch as well. And just hopefully they get up. If they don't, we have a bit of a problem. Potentially. Though it's not like we're losing. We just can... Uh, can get complicated. We'll see how it goes. Especially if there are mechs. Are there mechs? No, there aren't. Should be able to kill this. Do you go up? That's the question. No, I don't think they do. At least not this officer. Oh, oh some of them do. Two alive. That dead. Doesn't matter anymore. Um, now the only problem that could happen still, I'll kill that. That that is also not an issue. Okay. Look, um, we need to kill this thing. And ideally with you, yes. Yes. So I assume I'll still need to evacuate after that, that's the issue. You still don't see it, really. Okay, then well yes, yes, then you do hit it. Just try to kill it. I really need to do that. Good. Now, my specialist can actually just run back. Uh-huh. One grenade there. Yes. I know. I was, uh, yeah... I knew something like... I knew I would need to evacuate them as well. Seems obvious. So, I'm not sure... Hmm. I'll need one grenade on the lower ground officer. And then I will also need um, some hits. Where's my... Ranger? I can get closer, but this is not um, not a flank though. This is a flank, potentially, but they might be... No, they will not be able to see me. They will not be able to see me. There? Ridiculous. They will not be able to. Let's start with this one. Also, that was a mistake, because now I don't really see the officer anymore. Can I approximate his position? Who is, like, the closest to this guy? You? You? I don't see him. I need to be sure. Hmm. Do I just move there? Roger that. Okay, good. Uh, just do one grenade there. Just one grenade. We should be fine. We should be fine. Just uh, get closer. Maybe I don't even need to get closer. Yes, this is good enough. You're in a safe position. Yes, just go. And then one more reinforcement pack. And we actually should be able to run after that one. If everything goes, like, reasonably well. Okay, okay, so... You go back. Um, right there right now, I guess. You change your position slightly. You can actually get back immediately. Right from there. So you don't really need to change your position. Overwatch. 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 Reload. Overwatch. 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 Troops 
I think this pack we still need to kill. But after that, it's no longer no, no longer necessary. Uh, I can just get all of my troops to evacuate. Mech is dead. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine. I can ignore them for sure. So, let me check all of my soldiers. Can they all evacuate? Yes, 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 yes. You can't, but that's to be expected, yes. What about you? You can evacuate. Okay. Wait. Oh, no. I, I cannot place another evac zone. That would be ridiculous, yes. Um, so I don't need to go anywhere. I can just stand in place for one more turn. Do we have, like, more grenades? Well, you have a grenade. That can happen. Oh, I can justice. Actually. Let's do so. I also don't exactly remember if justice ends his turn or not. So, let's see how that works. Well, and let's start actually moving back. On the move. Little by little. Enemy destroyed. Destroyed. Moving to designated coordinates. Where's my specialist? Need to evacuate him as well. Um, they should be good enough. So just get there. Oh, and just wait one more turn, and I think we're done. Mox will definitely be able to run. You as well. Okay, we're fine. Next turn we evacuate, pretty much regardless of what is happening there. Four troops, so it does get rougher as time goes on. Though at this point I could like obviously do that for a while. <laughs> like if I don't need to move anywhere and I can just stay and uh, do this every turn. I don't exactly have any issues. And that's, that is with me, like, having two less soldiers than I could have, because I lost two of them. Yeah, whatever. Doesn't matter. I highly doubt I would be able to get more XP at this point. I don't think uh, you can farm it that easily. Well, let's start. Let's start with the most, like, questionable people. Questionable in terms of whether I would be able to actually evacuate them or not. So, you, for example, can you evacuate? Wait, what? Wait, you can't? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, but let's just, let's just go anyway, because I probably can just press the button and that would be it. Yeah, I can press the button to lift off Avenger. We'll abandon all soldiers not in the extraction zone. But, like, if I just get them there, that should be good enough, right? I'm on it. it shouldn't be a problem. I'm on it. A long approach. Position confirmed. Double time. Moving to designated position. Something like this. That Is that all of them? Okay, recover soldiers, soldiers remaining one, soldiers remaining zero. Can we shoot? Not anymore, no. So I just press this button then and is that it? Soldiers remaining zero. 
nothing else to do. Can maybe heal someone? Do I have like uh, med packs still? No. I used it at the beginning of it at some point. Well then, let's go. That was a rough one. That was a rough one. Two soldiers killed. And uh, one of them was Reaper. Which is very unfortunate. I liked her. I'm not sure how to actually get those uh, faction classes yet. Get more of them. <laughs> those were actually bonded together. Very poetic death overall. Uh, so all of those photos are just in one big pile. The game doesn't discern between them. It doesn't seem appropriate. I think the same text is uh, appropriate actually for those. And that's the Bond photo as well. Well then, a lot of wounded people as well. Not really much I can do about that. And some suppression on Grenadiers. Mooks? I don't know man. Uh, Wrath, use the grapple to pull yourself to an enemy and deliver a ripjack strike. So instead of uh, moving enemy towards you, you move yourself towards an enemy. Could be cool. Zero in, subsequent shots on the same turn provide plus 10 critical chance. If against the same target, they also provide plus 10 hit chance. Yeah, pretty good. Saturation fire, fire cone shaped barrage of bullets at every enemy in an area. In addition, the cover of those enemies can be damaged or destroyed. Uses a lot of ammunition. Ow. Might be good, but like, I use a lot of Grenadiers though, so it's not necessary, probably. Um, let's try a Wrath. Sure. Okay then. Yay! Incredible. Rest required. Well, we'll do that. Oh my god, okay. I definitely need to rest after this. So, oh yeah, well, mm, first losses. What can we do? What is this? Negative trade acquired. Chance to panic when missing a shot, but... That's old news, no? Yeah, but I already knew that. That was already happening before. Well, anyway, for now, thanks for watching, and we'll continue with this mess in the next episode.